Ah, good morning, my Mixin and Merchant followers. How is everybody doing on this Wednesday? It is hump day. I am trying to make every Wednesday a hmm. Is that really true or does that really happen? Hmm. Wednesday hump day. There are so many things that I can think of to talk about, to discuss about. Today, anyways, before we start, I just want to make sure everybody's having a great day. Fixing my little dress here. Today I actually curled my hair and it looked good in the house. Before I went out, I hairsprayed it, made it sit in, and it's like, because of this heat, first of all, my glasses like fog up instantly when I walk outside. Today, not so much, but it's gonna get hotter, so that's why I wanted to do this video earlier in my day. How is the beautiful lake? I come to my mix and match mellowers, my mix, mix in and matching followers today to talk about weird facts that make you say, what the fuck? As you remember, a couple weeks ago, I had discussed to you followers about vaping, vabbing, whatever you call it. I've gotten so many views over that, and that is because everybody likes weird, interesting, strange facts or different things that people are doing, correct? Or even if it comes down to even in your job, if you're working in a warehouse, if you're working in customer service, if you're working in a food factory, whatever, fast food, whatever, people do weird things that make you go, hmm, did you just fucking hear what just happened right now? I'm going to go through a few, just, and it may not be weird to some of you, but there are some weird ones. And it's just interesting. So, weird, interesting hump day for Wednesday. First thing, number one, we are going to talk about an average fact about falling asleep. And guess, oh, okay. Well, it can take many of us a little while to fall asleep. The night before an exciting day, maybe out for Christmas Eve, it takes the average person just seven minutes to fall asleep at night. I feel like it takes me longer. I feel like I want to put this in a bun or what, but I don't know. Anyways, listen to what I'm saying and don't listen to what I'm doing with my hair. Adult sleep less than seven hours a day, which is true. And that is probably because of stress, thinking about shit. Maybe you don't have the perfect mattress to be able to sleep in, or you're just, you just can't sleep. And I said, especially on a Monday morning, uh, I would assume so because everybody hates Mondays. It's the start of a new week, work week. Oh. My peeps were wrong with this today. Now, number two, let me get down to this. An average about, and I don't like the word, but you, it doesn't matter, farting. I don't like that word. It just sounds disgusting to me. I don't know, it just sounds weird. They say that we fart between five to 15 times a day. Now, if you have a, if you, if you have a mate, a partner, <laughs> imagine the double. <laughs> and it absolutely disgusting. It is heart, heart. It is hard outside, heart. No, it's hot outside. But it also says about farting, farting is natural and nothing to be ashamed of. Just try and do it when you're not around a loads of people or in a broken lift. I don't know, that's what it said, so. I, I don't, 
I don't fart. And if I do, it smells like roses. <laughs> All right. Number three, an average fact about getting, about going to the toilet. According to experts, we go, it says we go wee wee huh, six or seven times a day on an average. It can be a little more if we drink water or lots of pop, of course. But it says if we, it said the word P-O-O-P, which I don't like using either, but it says on your number two, you should go between three times a day or three times a week. Hold on. Three, between three times a day or three times a week. That don't even make sense. Okay, the next thing, I got to move my phone a little bit. My peeps, am I sorry? Number four, an average about our yawning. The average person will yawn about 245 240,000 times in their lifetime. Let me see. Because even when you say yawn, it makes you want to yawn. Yawn. No. Not at this moment. But it says a yawn lasts around six seconds. So we spend over 16 hours a day overdoing it. And then it asks you if the question are you trying not to yawn right now and i am i am i kind of want to yawn <laughs> kind of contagious even over even over a phone call is contagious okay thought i heard some number five an average about walking the average person will take about four thousand steps a day steps a day which is roughly two miles. Some people aim for two, 10,000 steps and will often show off their apps to anyone who's interested in that. Anyway, that's about walking. We walk every day. We try to. An average fact about eggs, are you ready? The average hen lays 228 eggs a year. This is a lot of fried egg sandwiches. Let's get to some fun things too. An average thing about laughter, which is number seven, numero siete, the average person laughs 10 times a day. I enjoy laughing. And I also heard if you laugh, it also helps your heart as well. Yeah, basically that's all I was saying. The average person <laughs> laughs 10 times a day. That's a lot, but if you got the average person to read not just the bueno, but also Danny Wallace's new book, The Luckiest Kid in the World, then the average person would be laughing millions of times a day, and that's just a scientific fact. An average fact about, oh, I said fucked about so, sorry. An average fact about spuds. In the UK, the average person will consume about 500 potatoes a day. That could be roasties, jacket potatoes, mashed potatoes, or chips. Cool. And we already talked about that. Okay, so let's talk about really what I'm coming coming down to you, my, my peeps, about people do weird things every day. Or also the other video that I did, like I said, also the jabbing or the jabing, whatever you call it. And also the ones that wear their pants all the way down to the floor. And this is what I'm about to talk about. Customer service. DJ Daywalker received a phone call last week. It was a girl, I forgot her name. She was claiming she was from Medicare or Medicorp. So in my book, 
that would be something from the medical field, correct? And she was acting because we all get phone calls that are like 1-800 or like weird calls that we don't want to answer or anything like that. We got this one call and she was like, I just want, I'm from Medicare or Medicorp, whatever. I just want to know how you're doing today, sir. Well, Mr. Mr. DJ Doc Daywaka, he proclaimed to say what she was, but you're just fucking with the other person on the other line. And he was like, I am not doing so well today at all. You wait, I would say six seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six. Her response was, after DJ Daywalker said, I am not doing so well, she says, goodbye. He was like, did you fucking just hear what I just said? What she just said? And I'm like, yeah, I'm super like, I don't even know what to say. I'm conflicted. I'm, I'm so confused at the moment. What is this about? So as customer service come down to the fact of if someone says they don't feel good or they're not doing good, you're going to hang up on them or we're going to hang up on them. <laughs> That is a Wednesday of, hmm, that is so weird. Would they ever do that? And you question, hmm, every Wednesday. So I come to you with a few different facts and things that make you go, hmm. I hope you keep subscribing. I am getting more. It is hot as a sun scorching. It's so hot. It's very very hot out here <sighs> I do hope that you all keep subscribing to my YouTube I been keep, get I keep getting new subscribers every day also on my Facebook and my Instagram mix and imagine please all keep happy that Zen peace of mind and I have that one that's just floating over my head I hope you all have a wonderful day and Peace out.